Hello everyone, and welcome back to another Zombie Uprising video. Can't really do my normal intro because uh, a little preoccupied here, but yeah, I've been working on the new, the recent Battle Pass. So I'm currently working on the Melee quest. And after using Melee a bunch of times, I've come to the realization that Melee is lying to us. In case you haven't noticed, as you can see, Melee does us, as you can see, with the laser saber, I'm doing a slash. And you would say this is a sword, right? Saber is a type of sword. This one's just a laser saber. Oh my goodness, she died again. Okay. You know, maybe if she watched my uh, guide to this game, she might have, you know, she wouldn't be dying so much. Okay, so, you know, I have a sword. But when I swing it, and you would agree that these are slashes, right? See, I'm slashing. But when you slash at a weapon, or when you hit something, you see the damage? That's not a slash. If anything, the closest you could get to that with a sword is with a thrust. Yet, as you can see, you're clearly not thrusting. All right? So, yeah, and pretty much every melee weapon is like this. Not only that, as you can see, I swung right through these guys. Like, right. I, I, I'm swinging right through them, yet I missed a bunch of times. Like, the blade passed right through them. That would, that should damage them, but it doesn't. So, yeah, unfortunately, these weapons, these melee weapons, don't function as realistically as they should. So, yeah, I am calling for a melee weapon upgrade. A melee weapon buff. To make them more realistic. Slightly. I mean, I know there are, like, glowing weapons and, you know... This type of lightsaber doesn't exist. But we do have lightsabers. I mean, we do have lightsabers. Currently, we have developed plasma-based lightsabers. Just not like this, exactly. I think it would be fair for melee to function like actual melee. So, like, sword slashing would actually function like a slash instead of a because right now, with the way it is, so what I'm calling for is the, the range to stay the same. So, you know, it would, you would still have to use it at close range. But, but the actual accuracy, basically, a, it would deal damage with a slash instead of a stab. Because, or no, a bullet. Let's get real. This is functioning just like a gun, okay? It's basically a gun. I've spoken to people, now you might think this is overpowered, this might make melee way too strong, but no, it won't. You can balance this out by keeping, you know, no buffs to damage, it won't deal more damage, it won't have longer range, or anything else. Literally, all it would do is remove the necessity of the crosshair. As you can see... It didn't kill him until the crosshair was on him, like a gun. But this isn't a gun, all right? This is a sword. It should function like a sword. And if you still think that's too overpowered, then you can still have it hit one single enemy at a time. That way you can still get completely over... You can still get overwhelmed by large hordes of enemies. In fact, guns would still be better because you can... Even if you don't have to be as accurate, if you got, like, three enemies really close together, you know, if you got, like, multiple enemies really close together like this, I'd still only be hitting one at a time. It would just be, you know, the one closest to the crosshair. It would still function like this. I would just, you know... These two would just already be dead. Because I'd already hit them. So, you know, it can still hit, like, one enemy at a time. Just, you don't have to hit them with the crosshair. You don't have to put the crosshair directly on them to hit them. They just have to be within the range. That would be a lot more realistic functionality of melee. 
and make melee builds just a lot better. Because, yeah, there's people who like melee builds, people who prefer it, but let's be real, it is nowhere near as good as just using a gun right, in this game because of that required accuracy. Because, you know, guns, you know, because right now, swords unfortunately require the same exact accuracy that you require with a gun. You're not stabbing with the lightsaber, you're slashing with it. So it should function like a slash. It would be pretty neat to see a melee overhaul for those who prefer just straight melee builds. Maybe add like different effects to different, maybe add like different effects to different melee weapons. Like lightsabers will light enemies on fire because you know, it's a blade of superheated plasma. It's a blade of a really because the blade is, you know, plasma. It's a plasma blade. It should burn things. Maybe a bleed effect as well for katanas and other metal, metallic melee weapons. And then hammers and stuff, like blunt force weapons, could give, like, a short, you know, maybe, like, five seconds of slowness to any anything it hits. That would be pretty neat as, like, a melee overall. It would give more functionality to the melee because... Unfortunately, whether you like melee or you don't like it, it's just not as good as it should be. So yeah, that's just my thoughts on it. it that's just my thoughts on it. If you have any, if you have any thoughts on it, please be sure to let us know in the comments. And yeah, I'll just end the video there. It's meant to be just a short little rant on melee weapons, and yeah. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed, if you did, please be sure to leave a like and hit subscribe. And yeah, that my friends, sign on.